Hello. Good evening. Hello, good evening. How was your day? Good evening, everyone. Good evening, teacher. Thank you so much. Okay. Let me share my. Can you see? Can you see my? Yes, teacher. Okay, yes, okay. okay, very good. Just a moment, please. Hey, welcome everyone, the ones that are here. Thank you so much for your attendance. Ana Maricela, Azucena, Guadalupe, Geraldine, uh, Ingrid Maudalena, Marjorie, Norma Lisette, Norma Leticia. Okay, thank you for your attendance. Welcome to the class uh, 14, okay, this is the class 14. Uh, we are missing just this class and then two more, okay, to complete the model number three. So the agenda for today, we have the lesson objective, we have simple pass of the verb B. We're going to continue working on that, reviewing that. And uh, um, we have also, review about reg regular and irregular birds, okay? At the end, we will, we will have a conversation. Um, also, we are, I am still working, reviewing your, your paragraph that you wrote yesterday, okay? Um, the objective for today, at the end of this, this class, you will be able to answer, um, Questions about past tense, okay? Using the verb to be and WH questions. Okay, let me... I have a review again about the, the verb be, okay? We need to make sure that we uh, know how to apply the verb to be in past, okay? Positive or negative. Okay, what will be the auxiliary to make the equation? Mm -hmm. Was, where, wasn't, or weren't. Which one do you think? We're going to learn how to make questions today using the verb to be. The auxiliar in this case will be where, okay? Where Tony and Harry at the zoo? Okay, estamos preguntando que si ellos estaban en el zoológico, okay? Where? Don and Harry at the zoo. Okay, that was the one question. Okay, now it's a it's a it's a positive uh, statement. My dog. Uh huh. What will be the correct option? 
mí una pregunta. No sé si solo es a mí, pero me, no sé si está presentando como la dinámica que se está haciendo las preguntas, porque al menos a mí me sale el manual educativo que está presentando. No sé si es eso. Sí. Sí, eso aparece, porque la pregunta que aparece a mí es, what's Victoria, Victoria doing? She's sleeping right now. Eso es lo que vemos en la pantalla. Ok, let me, let me stop sharing, let me share again. A screen too. Sorry about that. I didn't realize. What about now? Can you see it now? Yes, Miss. Yes. Okay, good. What will be the option my dog? Was. Was. My was. Was in the garden this morning. Okay, good. Uh huh. The lions. Where? 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 The lions. Where? Is too? Okay, very good. The horses. Wearing. 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 Wearing in the park. They were in the country. In the country. Okay. You have a new sweater. Were you at the shop yesterday? Were you at the shop yesterday? Okay, the girl, uh huh, was was with her dog in the park. Okay, good. Ah, uh, no sé si alguien tiene dos. Ah, uh, está conectada de dos devices de la computadora y del celular. Le ponga mute a uno, por favor. Okay, her pet. Where in the garden? Where in the garden? Where okay. in the garden? Very good. During lockdown, some animals was was where. Where? Where in the natural habit? Where? Huh? In the natural habit. Or where? In, okay, in this case, it's, it's negative. Where? Where? In, okay. Okay. This is a question. How you are going to make the question here? Where? Where? Were they at the party last night? Were they at the party last night? It was, it was. They. Because we're talking about they. That is why it's weird. Okay. How we are going to complete the, the, the sentences here? Were you? Sister. Was your at sister? Was your sister yesterday? at the cinema yesterday? She wasn't with you. Okay, very good. Now people can walk uh, along the coast during the lockdown. If uh, Uh -huh. Before, 
possible. Yeah. Mm. What? Because yeah. we are using E. Okay, we are using E. That is why it's, um, why is the number 12? That is why it wasn't. Here is I. Wasn't. I wasn't at I school wasn't yesterday. yesterday. I wasn't. Okay, very good. Um, on the long I think that we are good, we are okay. Um, with the bird to be in the past, but we have more, more, um practice here, okay? So question with the, with the pass of B, okay? Were you born in the US? Yes, I was, or no, I wasn't, okay? Where, where were you born? I was born in Korea. Was your, bro your brother born in 1984? Yes, he was, or no, he wasn't, okay? We have two, two options to answer that question. When was he born? He was born in 1985. Were your parents born in England? Yes, they were, or no, they weren't. What city were you born in? They were, they were born in Seoul. Okay, so we have the yes, no questions. Okay, the ones that you're going to answer like a yes I, or not, you're going to give just an answer like a yes or not. And the WH questions, you know, that is when we are going to provide more information. Okay, vamos a dar más información. Cuando hacemos los WH questions. In this case, is asking where, when, in what city. Okay, is because we need to give information. Okay. Is it clear that part? Yes, miss. Yes? Okay, very good. Okay, now we're going to, to word this, to complete these um, sentences here, these questions. Were you born in this city? Were you born in this city? Uh -huh. What? When? What will be when the night was born? When were you born? Please mute your microphones. When were you born, right? That would be the correct uh, question. Were your parents born, okay? When? Then. When? Uh -huh. Where do mother born? Where? When was? Remember that we're talking about she. Just about him. Okay. Estamos hablando sobre ella. When was your mother born? What about number five? Was. When was your father, when was your father born? born? Okay. Number six. Where? Where? 
where you and your family in this city last year? What about number seven? Where? 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 Mm -hmm. Where you at this school last year? What about number eight? Who was? was. Who was? Who was your first English teacher? Who was your first English? Your first English teacher. Okay. What nationality? Uh huh. Was. 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 Uh huh. Your first English teacher. What? Where? What were he or she like? What was he or she like? Remember that it, it will be was because we're talking about he or she. Estamos hablando bien de él o de ella. Okay, de uno. What was he or she like? Okay, if I ask you these questions, how are you going to answer that? Okay, let me ask. Um, let me ask someone. Uh, okay, volunteers, raise your hands. I will ask. I will ask you this question. You can see there, and you are going to answer them. Okay, Luis. You're going to answer then uh, using your information, okay? Su propia información. Perdón, perdón, no le escuché, es que, alguien, es que se oye interferencia. Sí, usted va, usted va a contestarme usando su propia información, okay? For example, if I ask you where, where you were in this city? Yes. Uh -huh. I... I was born in Apopa City. Apopa City. Okay. When were you born? Uh, September 19, September 10th, 10th uh, 91. September 10, 1991. Okay. Okay. Where your parents were? Okay. Where? The place. Where your parents born? Uh, my parents was born. Where born? Were born in Wasapa City. Wasapa City. Wasapa. Okay. Okay. When was your mother born? Uh, she was born in Wasapa. Wasapa. Okay. And your father too in Wasapa? Uh, yes, of course. Okay. Were you and your family in this city last year? Perdón, no le escuché. Were you and your family in San Salvador last year? Uh, yes, yes, we was. We were. We were in this city last okay. year. Okay. Were you at, at, at well, were you at the university last year? Uh, no, no, I I didn't, no. I wasn't. I wasn't study in the university okay. last year. Okay, who was your first English teacher? Do you remember? Yes, uh, she, he was. He, he was. 
Ah, se me, se me, me desconcentré. She was. <laughs> eh, creo que. Ah, she was. Eh, oh, he, he, her name is. Her name is. Her name was. Well, yeah. you can say, yes, I mean, it, it, we're talking in past, you can say, she was. She was, es que lo sentí algo fuera de lugar. She was, eh, ay, se me olvidó el nombre también. Okay. Eh, Jenny, Jenny, Jenny. Jenny. Miss, Je, Miss Jenny. Okay. Okay. What was he? What was he or she like? You remember? Eh, no le entendí. What was he, she like? You said that was Jennifer. What no. was he like? Eh, yes, eh, he, he, she was very pro professional. Professional, okay. Okay, good. Thank you so much, Liz. Okay. okay, very good. Who wants to participate again? You're going to answer you're going to answer these questions. Uh-huh. Who is ready to participate? Just you are going to answer these questions. Do you know that information? No one? Nobody? Okay, well, no problem. So we're going to continue, but try to answer then. Oh, Catherine, Andrea. Okay, Catherine. Okay. Where you born in this city? In San Salvador? Uh, no, I wasn't. And I was born in Sonsonate. Sonsonate. Okay, good. When were you born? I was born in August, August. 24. 24. What is the year? O sea, en 2004. Oh, okay, 2004. Oh, okay, gracias. 2004, okay. Um, where your parents born? Or when, uh -huh, where your parents born? Do you remember? Where, the place? They were born in Sonsonate. Sonsonate too, okay. When, when was your mother when was your mother born? Do you remember the date that she was born? Um, she was born in 1982. 82. Okay. And your father? Um, when was your father born? He was born in 1976. 76. Okay. Were you and your family in Sonsonate last year? Yes, they were. We were, because este también se está incluyendo, okay? We, yes, we were. Oh, okay. okay. Mm -hmm. Were you at high school last year? No, I wasn't. I wasn't study university. Oh, you were, you were at the university. Okay. 
Who was your first English teacher? Do you remember? I was. Um, um, his name is um, Gabriel. Okay, his name is Gabriel. Okay, good. Uh, what was he like? What was he like? Como era él? <clears throat> um, he was um ¿Cómo sería para decir alto? Tall. Oh, okay. Um he was tall. Mm -hmm. um, so funny? Funny. Okay. <laughs> What else? Um, just that. Okay. Well, thank you, Katherine, Andrea. Very good. Okay. That was good. Oh, Marjorie. Marjorie want to participate too. Okay, Marjorie. Were you born in this city? In San Salvador? Stay mute. Are you Yes. Uh, no. Uh, I I wear. No. I, no. No. I wasn't. I what? Uh, no, I wasn't. And this city. When Ilocano. were you born? When oh, were yeah. you born in the city? Ilopango. Ilopango, okay, where? Okay, now when? When were you born? Okay. Uh, uh, 24 July. Uh, na... Nine, 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 uh, 1995. 95, okay. 95. Okay, first will be the 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 month. You said July. ¿Qué mes? Perdón, ¿qué mes dijo? July, Julio. July 24th. Okay. July 24th. Primero es el mes, después el día y después el año. Okay. 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 Were your parents born in uh, Ilopango too? Mm, no. Eh... She was, they was. They went. They went in. They, in were, they were born in. They were born in the Salvador. Okay. When, when, okay. When was your mother, your mother born? She went. She was. She was. Pardon. She was uh, born. In 29, uh, perdón, August 29, el año no me lo puedo. Okay, and do you remember about your father? When was uh, father August, August 8, el eight. año no me lo puedo. Okay, eight. the same month, okay. <laughs> okay, where are you and your family? In Ilopango last year? No, in San Salvador. Okay. No. Ajá, ¿Cómo sería la respuesta cor eh, completa? No, no, no were. No, we were. No, we. No, we weren't. were. We weren't. Or we, we were weren't. not. Okay. Were you at the university last year? No. No. no, 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 where? No, I wasn't. No, I wasn't. Okay. Who was your first English teacher? Yes, his name, his name, 
Uh, her name. Her name is Rina Zavala. Rina, okay. What was she like? Mm. Para decir muy enojada. <laughs> she was very. She was very hungry. Hungry, okay. Ajá. ¿Cómo decimos cuando tenemos hambre? Hungry. Hungry. Okay. ¿Y enojada? Hungry. Hungry. Okay. Very good. Very good, Marjorie. Thank you so much for that information. Okay. Try to practice more, okay? Veo que todavía un poquito se me, se me traban. Eh, traten de practicar más, okay? Porque eso solo es de práctica. Okay. Good. We're going to continue. Okay, we have a conversation here. Who wants to read that conversation? It is about where did you grow up? Donde crecieron? Donde creciste? Okay. Uh -huh. Ana Maricela? Who else? Mm -hmm. Ingrid Maudalena. Okay. You will be the first one. Okay, um, Ana Maricela, you will be Melissa. And Ingrid will be Chuck. Go so, ahead. Chuck. So, Chuck, where did you grow up? I grew up in Texas. I was born there too. And when did you come to Los Angeles? In... 19, 19, I went to college here. Oh, what was your major? Drama, I was an actor for five years after college. That's interesting. So why did you become a higher life? Hair, no stylist. Sé hair, stylist. Hair, hair stylist. Hair stylist. That's interesting. So, why did you become a hair stylist? Because I needed the money, and I love it. Look, what do you think? Well, um. Mm -hmm. What do you think about that? Uh, ahora ustedes van a decir qué piensan al final. My opinion. Well, your opinion. Uh -huh. Well, I think that is good. Or well, um, I don't like it. I don't know. What is your opinion about that? Well, I think you need a, um, a new haircut. Nuevo corte de cabello. Okay, a new haircut. Okay. Good. Very good. Thank you so much. Okay, you did it very good. Okay. Grew up. Grew up. That is the that is the pronunci grew up. pronunciation of uh grew up grew up here and cuando ya está en pasado, okay? ¿Qué es en presente? Grow up. And here is grow up. Grow up. Grow up. Okay, very good. Now will be uh, Norma, Leticia, and Marjorie. Go ahead. Thank you. Okay. So, Chu, where did you grow up? I grew, I grew up in Texas. I was born there too. And when did you come to Los, Los, Los Angeles? Angeles? 
Los Angeles. Los Angeles. Los Angeles. In, in 1990, I went to college here. Oh, was oh, what was your ma major? Major. 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 Mm -hmm. major. Drama. Drama. I was an actor for five years after college. That's inter interesting. So why did you be become a hair, hair, hairstyle? Hair stylist? Hair stylist. Because I need I need the money and I love it look. What do you think? Well, ooh, I was see. Mm -hmm. Well, I think well, that is that is a well, good that is a good uh job. You can say your opinion there. Any any of that eh, cualquier idea que usted tenga. Oh, que se ve um, eh, beautiful, o sea, linda. Okay, well. Well, beautiful. O cómo sería? Es que, ok, Melissa está dando la opinión. ¿Qué opina como de ese trabajo? Ok. Oh. Because he said, he said uh, because I need the money and I love it. Ok. Oh. Look, what do you think? Ok, acerca del trabajo. Le está pidiendo oh. su opinión. Oh, ok, no le había entendido. Thank you. So you can give your opinion about the job. What is not the job that he is doing now? Ok. Um, let me see now Reina Leticia and Lillian. Lillian Eunice and Reina Isabel. So, Chuck, where did you grow up? I grew up in Texas. I was born there too. And when did you come to Los Angeles? In um, 1990, I went to college there. College? Oh, college there. College there. Oh, what was your major? Drama. I was an actor for five years after college. Thanks. Interesting. So, why did you become I are stylist because I need the money and I love it. I love it. Look, what do I do you think? Well, um. Well, mm -hmm. I need my make my nails. Okay. So in this case, podemos podemos pensar de dos formas. Cuando le pregunta what do you think, puede ser que le está preguntando acerca de de cómo se cómo quedó el look de ella o cómo o qué piensa acerca del trabajo. ¿verdad? Look, what do you think? Okay. Uh, ¿Cómo lo podría interpretar usted? ¿Cómo lo interpretan? Si que está preguntando acerca de cómo se ve ella, ya con el look que le hizo, o 
Él está preguntando cuál es la opinión del trabajo. What is your um, interpretation? Well, uh, you are um, beautiful. Okay. Okay. It's a good job. Okay, good. Very good. Thank you so much. Okay, so now we're going to uh, continue here. Doing a review about WH questions with did, was, and where. Okay, vamos a hacer un repaso de las WH questions. Okay, como ya sabemos, las WH questions significa cuando lleva una palabra con doble A, con doble B y H. Okay, por ejemplo, estas palabras, where, when, why, how, what, and how was. Okay, how, in this case, how. Y está repetido dos veces acá. Okay, we have questions here. Where did you grow up? Okay, ¿dónde creciste? Okay, where did you grow up? I, I grew up in Texas. That is, the, that is the answer. Where did you come to Los Angeles? When, I'm sorry, when did you come to Los Angeles? I came to Los Angeles in 1990. Why did you become a, a health stylist? Because I needed the money. How old were you in 1990? I was 18. What was your major in college? It was drama. That, that are the answers that we have. Okay. Uh, how was college? It was great. Okay. The answers that we can have according to this to this conversation. Okay. Remember, para hacer las preguntas utilizando las WH questions, primero va a ir la palabra con WH. Luego va a ir el auxiliar did. O va a ir el auxiliar con el verbo to be. Ok. Y luego ya el sujeto y el complemento. ¿Tienen alguna duda entre la diferencia? ¿Cuándo, cuándo utilizamos did y cuándo utilizamos el verbo to be? Uh -huh. ¿Cuándo utilizamos did y cuándo utilizamos el verbo to be? ¿Preguntas? Diría Ok, supongo que estamos bien. Si yo los pongo que me escriban eh, dos preguntas utilizando WH with did y dos preguntas utilizando uh, WH with was or when. Ok, you are ready to do it. Yo supongo que están preparados para hacerlo, ¿verdad? Ok, we're going to continue with that practice, vamos a continuar con esa práctica these two days that we are missing, okay? To make sure that you can um, understand and also make the questions, okay? Hacer la estructura de esas preguntas. Pueden entender, dar, dar una respuesta cuando se le hace una pregunta con esa estructura y hacer la pregunta. Okay, we have here um, some questions. Okay, vamos a buscarle la respuesta a cada pregunta. When and where, when and okay. where were you born? What would be the answer? Letter C. Letter C. Okay. 
Very I good. I was born in 1983. In I was Hiroshima, born. Japan. Okay, good. I was born in 1983 in Hiroshima, Japan. Okay, very good. Where did you grow up? Little F. I grew, I grew up in Tokyo. Letter E. Okay, I grew up in Tokyo. When did you start school? Mm -hmm. Letter A. Letter G. I entered first grade in 19. 89. Okay. I entered my first grade in 1989. Okay. How was your first day of school? Better ish. It was a little scary. Okay. I was a little scary. Okay. How was your first day of school? Creo que está repetida esta. Okay, who, who was your friend in school? Letter B, she was really shy. Mm, her name was? Uh, yes. mm -hmm. How was? Ah, sí, confundí la, las preguntas. Okay, her name was Jamil. How was he or she like? Now will be letter V. Right? He was really shy. He was really shy. What did you take? Why did you take this class? I was six. I was six. Mm -hmm. Why did you take this class? Oh. My English my wasn't English very good. Very good. Letter E. Uh -huh. My English wasn't very good. Letter E. 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 Okay. Uh, Okay, I'm going to ask these questions to someone. Okay, who wants to answer them? Así como hicimos el ejercicio anterior, yo le voy a preguntar, no todas, le voy a preguntar dos o tres preguntas de esto. Mm -hmm. Who wants to participate? No one? Okay, Ana Maricela. Okay. Mm. How was your first day at a school or at the university? I don't know. You, you, what you remember? Lo que usted recuerde. I remember kinder grade. How was, uh, how was the first day? <laughs> I was uh, very scary. Okay. Who was your friend in school? I don't have any friend. You didn't? I didn't have. I didn't have any friend. Okay, okay. Why? Mm, no, no, it's unknown. Where did you grow up? Where? Mm -hmm. I grew up in Mexicanos. Mexicanos. Okay, very good. Thank you so much. Okay, Miguel. Okay. Uh, when did you start school? When did you start school? Do you remember? Um, 
not exactly, uh, but Two thousand one. Two thousand one. Maybe I don't remember. Okay. Um. Where did you grow up? Uh, it's number two. Number two. Uh huh. Uh, I I did grow grown up in San Salvador. I grew up. Okay, no va a utilizar el did, solo el verbo ya en pasado. I, el verbo I, que va a decir I grew up in San Salvador. Okay. Okay, very good. Thank you so much. Okay, very good practice. Okay, now I'm going to send this, this video to you. This will help you. It has more uh, examples. Tiene más, más ejemplos de cómo utilizar uh, WH plus D plus subject and then the rest of the sentences, okay? Vamos a ver ese video para que pueda entender un poco mejor. Se lo voy a dejar de tarea para que lo vean después de la clase. Ok. Um, Vamos a pronunciar los negative contractions here, ¿ok? Aquí están de una sílaba y aquí están de dos sílabas. La las sílabas cuentan con los sonidos que usted escucha o usted hace, ¿ok? Ok, for example, aren't. It is, it is just one syllable, ¿ok? Weren't. Don't. Can't. ¿Ok? But if I if I if I say isn't, son dos sílabas, okay, or doesn't, two syllables, wasn't, or didn't, okay, we have two two sounds there. Uh, tenemos dos sílabas, pero significa lo mismo, okay. Uh, for example. Well, it is not the same because here is in in in, uh, in it is in present, okay? And here is in the in past. Tenemos los 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 ejemplos en presente y los tenemos en pasado, okay? That is the difference. Aren't, weren't, okay? Don't, can't. Uh, aquí, puede, aquí está también en, en, en están también en presente ok, can isn't, doesn't pero aquí sí ya está en pasado ok, wasn't and didn't ok we have a short paragraph here tenemos un párrafo pequeño que es es en negación, ok, todo está negativo. They didn't eat dinner because they weren't hungry. I don't like coffee and she doesn't like tea. These aren't the swimsuits. They can't swim. He wasn't here yesterday and He isn't here today. Okay. Tenemos eh, información en, en, en ne negativa, pero tenemos en los dos tiempos, ok? Tenemos en pasado y tenemos en presente, ok? 
that is that is the the difference here okay we have didn't and we have don't okay we have weren't and we have aren't okay doesn't we have wasn't can't and isn't okay ¿Cuáles son las negaciones en pasado que tenemos? Tenemos didn't, weren't, and was. Ok, y en, y en, en, en presente, don, don aren't, aren't, isn't, doesn't. and can, right? Can. And doesn't, yes. Ok, very good. So now, um, como tarea, también les va a quedar esto. Write four sentences with negative contractions. Ok. Escriban cuatro oraciones con construct constructions que sean negativas. Ok. Pueden ser en presente o en pasado. Pero con negative contractions. Y here is an example. I didn't go. Because my friend weren't there, okay? I didn't go because my friends weren't there. Okay, eh, basados en el video, usted puede hacer las oraciones. En el video que les queda ahí. Let me take the attendance. Vamos a seguir mañana con esto para seguir eh, dando un repaso, ¿ok? Ok. Adriana Araceli. Ana Beatriz. Present. Present teacher. Ana Maristela. Present. Ok, Andrea Eugenia. Andrea. Mi es, yo le dije presente y no me anotó. Sí, es, es posible. Ok. Azucena. Presente. Francisco Valdomar. Presente, teacher. Geraldine. <coughs> Ingrid Maudalena. Present, Miss. Jennifer Vanessa. Jennifer. Jenny Elizabeth. Present. Jose Alejandro. Present teacher. Juan Carlos. Mm -hmm. uh, Catherine Andrea Mendoza. Present. Lilian Eunice Posada, the most. Present. Lourdes María. No, no. Ok. Luis, Miguel. Present. María Santos. Present, teacher. Marjorie, Marlin. Present. Moisés. Present. Norma Leticia. Present, teacher. Norma um, Lisset Crespin. Present teacher. Patricia Saray. Patricia. Present. Ok. Uh, perdón. perdón. Eh, Patricia Lisset y Patricia Saray. Están las dos. Present. Sí, Patricia Lisset, ¿verdad? Oh, no. ¿Y Saraí? Sí, sí. ¿Patricia Saraí? No, creo que no. Escríbame si, no la, si es que yo no la veo. Y no, oh, porque no, no la veo. Reina Isabel. Present teacher. Sandra. Present teacher. 
Stephanie Carolina? Present. Very good. Thank you so much. Ok, guys. Um, ok, les queda de tarea ver el video que les envié. De ahí pueden, pueden guiarse para que escriban ejemplos con um, negative contractions. Bueno, negative contractions, uh, you know how to do that. Okay, saben cómo hacerlo. Aquí están los ejemplos. Pueden hacer oraciones en pasado o en presente. Okay, four sentences. ¿Tienen preguntas? Sí, ¿cuántas oraciones serían? Four. Cuatro. Five, four, Mi siguiente pregunta se las tendríamos que mandar por chat. No, mañana, mañana se la voy a preguntar yo. Okay. Ok, pueden ser preguntas o pueden ser eh, solamente unas oraciones en, en negative contractions, ok, utilizando negative contractions. Miss, I have a question. Yes. We need to use two contractions. Um, four. You can, you can use four, uh, cuatro formas. Ok, de hacer construcción. De, por ejemplo, las que todas las que ven aquí, aquí tenemos ocho contractions. Puedo uh -huh. utilizar cuatro de estas. Pero en cada oración necesitamos utilizar dos contracciones. No. O podemos utilizar solo una. Pueden utilizar solo una. Ok. Ok. Thank you so much, guys. See you tomorrow. Thank you. Good night. 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 Good night